Hi everybody, this workout is a Coach Tam and Coach Ali mashup. You will need a weight plate and a pair of dumbbells to complete this workout. Working some push-ups for this exercise and we're getting some assistance from the bench just to create a little bit of elevation and this will make the push-up fairly easy. Just make sure you're cautious enough not to tip the bench over. Your turn to try this one. Close grip press or triceps press for this one. So you can see I've lifted my head in order to engage my core and support my back, but you could do it with your head on the bench as well. The important thing is keep your elbows tucked in and make sure the dumbbells are pressed against each other and we're just going to push up in a straight vertical line and then return it to your chest. Your turn. <laughs> Overhead tricep extension. Start standing tall with your feet at shoulder width. Extend your arms up until they are straight above your head. Curl your arms back down to your head and extend back up without moving your elbows. Steady controlled movement is key for these tricep extensions. Your turn. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you. 
rest and repeat the last two exercises. over from a supine position for this one so you can see I've got an eyelet grip going as far as holding the dumbbells concerned and then I'm keeping my arms relatively soft straight to really emphasize on the triceps now if you bend your arms a little bit more it's going to give you more emphasis on your chest so there is a variation your turn to try it Crush grip press is a squeeze of the chest and biceps to retain holding of the weight plate. Press forward, extending your arms to feel the weight transfer to your shoulders. Pull the weight plate back towards your chest with elbows out to the side. Have a go at this one. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you. 
let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. for some triceps dips for this exercise. Now you can see I'm doing it with straight legs so that I can't cheat. And you've just got to make sure that your butt stays really close to your hand. We don't want to cause any excess pressure in the rotator cuffs. Your turn to try this one. Bent over rows. Start this exercise similar to a deadlift by bending your knees and posturing forward with a neutral spine. Now keep legs static and pull up rows from here. Keep your elbows tucked in by your side and have steady control over your up-down movement. Your turn to try it. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you. 
Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Concentration curls. Now this is a great biceps isolation. So you can see I've got my elbow inside of my thigh and supported and all I'm doing is just pumping out some biceps curls perpendicular to my leg. So I'm going to hit one side and then I'm going to hit the other side as well. Your turn.
This exercise is bridge press. Lying in supine position, lift your hips into glutes bridge to start the exercise. Hold up your isometric bridge while getting through the set of chest presses. Don't drop your hips as you tire throughout your set. Full range of chest press from start to finish. Your turn. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises.
single arm row, nicely supported by the bench for this one. So very important, just release the dumbbell until your arm's nice and straight. And then when you pull it up, you want to pull towards your rib cage uh, with your elbows tucked in. Keep your wrists nice and straight and keep your spine neutral as well. Both sides, your turn. This exercise is bicep hammer curls. Hold the plate grips palm to palm and extend your arms down until they are straight. Curl up without moving your elbows. Keep your knees slightly bent and your spine neutral to protect your back. Let's do this for the next minute. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Thank you. 
Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. traditional lateral raise for this exercise. So seated on the bench with a neutral spine, nice sturdy base, and we're just lifting into these lateral delts raises with your wrists nice and straight and perfectly lateral movement. Now we're just gonna go slightly above shoulder height and we're gonna stop there and then we're gonna return the negative nice and slow. Your turn to try this one. Weight plate skull crusher for this exercise. Start lying in supine position with your weight plate rested on your forearm, holding the top edge for support. Extend your arms and then reverse curl until your hands are at your forehead. Extend back into straight arms without moving your elbows. This is a great variation of skull crushers because the plate forces you to do it with strict form. Have a go.
Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Let's rest and repeat the last two exercises. Well done for getting through your workout today. Let's take a moment to stretch our muscles and cool down. See you again very soon.